Where is Tomball, Texas? Are you considering a move to Tomball? You might be wondering what is the cost of living here in Tomball? What are the places to visit? Major employers and restaurants? I'll share them to you right now. Hi, Jennifer Yainko. Watch till the end of the video as I will provide you a free gift. My moving checklist is now available for download. So on to our topic. Where is Tomball, Texas? I don't want to bore you, so this will be real quick. I'll just give you a quick history as to how Tomball originated. According to TomballTX.gov, original settlers arrived from Europe. They found that land here in Tomball has rich soil, which is perfect for livestock and farming. Tomball was a railroad stop and was originally named Peck. And if you can see, if this was not renamed, I'll be talking about Peck, Texas. In ceremonies held on December 2 of 1907 at the now historic downtown depot, Peck was renamed Tomball. And this is in honor of the man responsible for routing the railroad and its operations through the small town. His name was Thomas Ball. On May 27 of 1933, the Humboldt Oil Company struck oil in the southwest of town, earning Tomball the nickname Oil Town U.S. Humboldt Oil Company, would you believe, is now known as Exxon. And Exxon, as you know, is still one of the major employers here in the greater Houston area. According to Niche.com, Tomball is a suburb of Houston. It has a population of around 11,535. Tomball is located in the Harris County and is one of the best places to live here in Texas. It offers a dense suburban feel. There are lots of parks here. There is the Jerry Madison Park, Spring Creek Park, and so much more. I'll cover the parks most probably in my next video, so you have an idea. There are also many families and young professionals who live here. The public schools in Tomball are also highly rated. If you notice in the map, it is around 42 minute drive to downtown Houston. My husband works in downtown Houston and he usually uses the HOB park and ride. What I mean by this is he parks his car in the park and ride garage, rides the bus, and he prepare, prefers this than driving all the way to Houston. And obviously, you know why, because of traffic, right? In this way, he can relax or read a book while in the bus. So far, it is working for us expense-wise, rather than moving and buying a house in a downtown area. As you can see, the homes here for sale in Tomball are still averaging around 213,000 above. Still a good value considering if you purchase a home near the downtown area. What is the cost of living here in Tomball? Let's say someone is moving from San Francisco, California, here in the greater Houston, Texas area. According to Nerd Wallet Calculator, I'll give the link for that, to maintain the standard of living, you need to earn 23988 The cost of living is 52% lower here in Houston. Housing costs is 75% lower. So for example, in San Francisco, a two median apartment rental will cost 4,128, while in here, the greater Houston, it's around 1,269. Median home price for a three bedroom, two bath in California would run at the one millions, while here it's around 295, 289. Take note that the calculator is measuring average cost of the large metro area and not just the city limits. Transportation cost is 31% lower. Uh, let's say at 3.82 per gallon in California is 2.34 per gallon here, and we, which I see a 1.95 recently, okay? Lower. Entertainment cost is 26% lower. Housing, healthcare cost is 28% lower. By the way, we also have no state income taxes. Though we have sales taxes, it is around 8.25%. 
property taxes here around in the municipal without the municipal utility districts or mud it's around 2.21 per 100 of value what are the things to do in Tombow or places to visit number one Tombow railroad depot plaza and gazebo it is a nice park with water splash pad a family friendly area that is not too crowded so kids can enjoy climbing the caboose and if you are into trains there are train exhibits which contains train memorabilia original works of arts and model railroad number two we have the tombles farmers market which is open every saturdays and uh, there's so many great vendors to choose from from baked goodies fresh meat fresh produce fruits every everything right it's Amer it's family friendly they have organic produce as well and there's plenty of parking we have klebs woods nature preserve if you like nature and de-stress yourself then this is the place to be it is a peaceful preserve made out of forests and wetlands you can hike here uh, there's ponds as well wildlife and forests you can also bird watch and so much more number four we have granny's corner uh, if you want antiques and into that da Vinci art gallery and so much more who are the major employers of Tombow according to Tombow Economic Development Corporation or TEDC by the way I'll include the link below the top employers are number one HP Packard with like 10,000 employees Tombow School District with 1478 Tombow Regional with 1,300 and Tombow Community College around 1,056. Baker Hughes Manufacturing Company around 680 employee. I say Lone Star College is excellent as far as uh, instructions. They're of high quality. I took a course here and I believe it's competitive as far as schooling or education system. If you look at the charts here, uh, you'll notice uh, Lone Star College is one is, is in the second top universities here in Tombaugh. Last but not the least, my favorite, Tombaugh, Texas restaurants. One of them is Tejas Chocolate Craftery. This is a combination of meat and chocolate. Ever heard of that? Their beef short rib has a cocoa spice rub and they have like a carrot souffle which is a custard-like dish. This is a very unique restaurant. We also have Mel's Country Cafe. There's really nothing fancy about this place, but their huge portions and price are the bomb. It's like a mom and pop shop. Good food in a simple down-home atmosphere. We also have Ghana Italian Kitchen, several fa restaurants, and many more. I guess I need to do another video because there are several here in my list. Anyway, there you have it. As promised, my moving checklist is available for download. Scroll all the way down in the description for the link below. I hope you have learned a lot about Tombow. And if you have plans of moving or relocating here in Tombow, give me a buzz. I'm sure to help you. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, notification bell to be part of my real estate tips and secrets. Again, this is Jennifer Uinko. You are my priority for anything real estate, serving Houston, Tombow Spring, and the surrounding cities. I'll see you next Tuesday. Bye.